Oh, John Jones was tested again, and he tested positive for trace amounts of PEDs, steroids. John Jones test positive again. Is there any doubt? Is there any doubt that he cannot be considered the greatest of all time? John Jones cannot be considered the greatest of all times because he is a drug user. Okay, so even though he tested positive with trace amounts, with very minuscule trace amounts, it doesn't matter. That's like me taking a drug that makes me grow taller and now I am eight feet and I'm dominating in the NBA and then they test me for that drug that made me taller and it's not in my body anymore, just a little bit, okay? But I'm already tall. I already benefited from taking that pill that made me taller, from taking that drug that made me taller. Taking those drugs, those PEDs, has a lifetime consequence on your body. It affects you for your entire life. And it's showing here with John Jones. He's still testing positive. John, you know what I don't like about John Jones is that he can't just man up and say, hey, I screwed up. He's constantly defending that PEDs and steroids don't work. I'm not against people taking all these drugs. Do what you want to do. But at least admit that it has benefit to your fighting ability, to your fighting skills. Don't say it's all you. You're taking drugs. You're taking drugs. They are moving the entire fight to Los Angeles. They're moving it from Las Vegas to Los Angeles so John Jones can still fight because Los Angeles is going to sanction and give him give John Jones his fight card. Las, Las Vegas would not sanction that fight. I mean, they would not give John Jones his fight card. So Dana White and the UFC decided to move it to Los Angeles. You know how insane that is? Thank God Dana White is on John Jones' side for this drug test. Otherwise, it wouldn't have happened. Otherwise, it's not going to happen. Now, Alexander, that guy's a beast. I hope he demolishes John Jones. John Jones is a very cocky, egg, uh, arrogant fighter. I don't like his style. Just come out and admit that steroids and PEDs are helping you, man. You are not the greatest of all time. John Jones cannot be considered the greatest of all time. I hope this message somehow finds him. He's a jerk.